What's going on guys? This is my 2020 Coleman CT200 UEX. As you can see, I did a modified exhaust. The exhaust is one of those eBay brand, Amazon brand, off brand for you know your Chinese scooter or I think even Honda Ruckus said it fitted. And kind of modified it to work on this bike because other words it wouldn't wouldn't work at all so here here you go there's a cut it right here we turned it 90 degrees and then we did a 40 degree turn on the flange if you buy the exhaust system itself you kind of just line it up mark it with a marker which was something i should have showed a video about but i didn't but uh Other than that, I mean, it sounds freaking awesome. It's a lot faster than it was. Um, so before I was averaging, let me check right here through my phone, I got pictures. So this is what I averaged, 46 miles an hour, 46 miles an hour. That was one of them and I redid it again because it didn't look right and this is where I'm at now 36 miles an hour this is what I kept on getting over and over again 36 miles an hour with a 20 mile an hour average um, when we first when we first started this uh, when I first got the bike we were at we were top speed was 19 that was that was the top speed of 19 and then I also seen where you go there. I think another top speed we got was 33. So what we did to the car, the motorcycle, besides this exhaust system, uh, we did this little mod here. You could also check out where you kind of stop the governor from going on sooner and pretty much that's it that's it uh 93 gas i put in here 93 gas and then we did this little modification here with the uh i guess it delays the governor is what it was i believe delays the governor but man this thing it's got some fucking torque now excuse my language it's got a little torque and i'm 230 pounds so take that you know take that as it is i'm 230 pounds and it's got me going pretty quick. Let me move it up here and we'll you can hear a sound clip. We got a guy about to cut the grass. The house next door. Alright, so we'll start her up. that's gonna sound on camera but it sounds awesome in person this thing is real torquey down low now I kind of changed the power band because I see my average speed and I, I didn't really get a um, good clip picture clip but my average speed my average speed got higher and my top speed got a little bit lower. I'm going to take it for another run and see if that changes at all. But before I put the exhaust on, my average speed was a little bit lower and my top speed was higher. Um, like I said, the only thing I got done to this is that little, I guess, tie wire modification. You might want to look it up on the internet. And it, it, uh, it, it had me at, I think I was around 33 miles an hour, went from 19 to 33 with just that little modification. Uh, it picked up speed pretty good. Uh, I'll go check it out. I'm gonna post a little bit more stuff. I don't think I'm gonna. I may get an intake filter for it. I also may cut this right, cut it right here, and angle it a little bit more on the inside. Uh, but um, I'm trying to think what else. Torque converter next. 
I don't know, I might not even do the intake because I heard that's just a waste of money and it's really a waste of time. The stock intake flows pretty good. But I may get it and try just to see what it does. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, I think I'll take you guys for a little spin with me. I get some complaints at the trailer park. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys again soon with another updated video. I've got Honda Civic 95, 92-95 Honda Civic Contact, uh, 04 to 2010 Ford F-350 Contact coming soon, diesel. Uh, and um, that's about it for now. See you guys.